it's Ruth here from Suffolk Libraries and today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own baby safe paint. So paint is a great way for young children to explore mark making and it's a really good sensory activity for them. Uh, but as we know, babies love to put things into their mouths and some of your more traditional paints that you can buy from an art or craft suppliers um, are full of things that you wouldn't really want for them to be eating. So if you have a go at this recipe, um, all it is is corn flour and water. And so although it won't taste delicious, if they do put it in their mouths, there's nothing harmful in there at all. So this recipe is great for babies from around the age of six months months when they can sit in a high chair and um, pop an apron on them, give them some paint and let them explore it with all their senses. If they want to get their hands in it, if they want to put it in their mouths, that's all completely fine. They'll probably be more interested at this age in exploring it with their hands than they will be with using a brush. Um, but you could give them a brush, you could give them a fork. Um, if it's older children and they can begin to do some mark making with different tools uh, and really it, be interested in the process of how they're making marks, how they're putting marks onto the paper. So the first stage of making the paint I've already done in the kitchen. So what's gone into my bowl so far, it's been 250 grams of corn flour, 250 millilitres of cold water and a litre of boiling water. So this is not a recipe that you want to make with your little ones because it does involve heat and hot water. Um, make this in advance and if you pop it into some jars you can keep it in the fridge and it will keep for about two to three weeks. Um, so I've put it all into a saucepan and then you want to heat it gently on the stove, um, a nice gentle heat until it all starts to come together. Keep stirring it, it will begin as a liquid but as time goes on, as you heat it, it will all thicken up and it will start to become like a custody consistency. So that's what it's like now, it's like this really thick custody goo. And now is the time when you can add your colours. So what I'm going to do is I've just got three empty jam jars here and I'm going to put some of this into each jar. And we're going to make three colours today. So I'm going to make red, blue and yellow, our three primary colours. So there's one jar. And here's my second jar. Drop that in. And then my third jam jar. Right. And then all you need to do is add your colours. And I've got lots left in the bowl, so you could make lots and lots of different colours um, and then have a whole variety of paints available for your child to explore. So this one we're going to make blue. So I've just got a brush and a bit of food colouring. So drop your food colour in and give it a stir. And then as you can see, um, that's gradually all turning blue. And there you've got your blue paint, all ready to go. Uh, this one we're gonna make red. Drop that in. And the last one is going to be yellow. So you give your jars a good stir. If it's a little bit thick, you can add a little bit more liquid. Uh, if it's a little bit runny, just add a bit more corn flour until you're happy with the consistency of the paint that you've got. And there's my red one. And there we go. All ready for baby to explore. Enjoy. Bye.